Hi, welcome everyone. I am here to channel the energy right now for all the signs. Everyone is welcome. My name is Tisa, by the way, from Scentstar555.com. And we will be looking right now into all the signs. This is April the 26th and the 27th of 2024. Uh, happy birthday to the sign of Taurus. I really do hope that you're enjoying your birthday season. This reading here, take what resonate, read the rest. Don't make something fit here. It's not a story. I will be pulling a couple cards right here from the, um, you know, the index cards first, and then I will use the traditional tarot as well. Okay. All right, let's see what we have here in this energy check here. We have ATM flipping out here. So it looks like you're going to the ATM for some people here. Maybe you are. Okay, you could even be investing in an ATM so you can have some like passive income or something. Hmm. Have you thought about that? Or like starting a laundromat or something like that right here? A parking lot? These right here will be great ways to earn money. Okay? With minimum effort. Okay? Good health is here. All right, let's see here. What's the message here, please? Message for all sides. Everyone's welcome here. Okay, we have a low-key millionaire. Yeah, so I feel like some of you right here, right? Maybe you're thinking about investing in something, right, like that. Like a vending machine, um, a parking lot. See, like the vending machine. Only thing you need to do is make sure that the machine works, right? That it can accept the payments and things like that through the machine. And then you need to make sure that the machine is stopped. So that's pretty much all you have to do with a vending machine, Okay. Then, or you have to also maybe rent where, you know, you put the rented machine is at. Another thing, parking lot, for example. So you rent out the parking lot space, okay? And then you have a machine there to collect the money through credit cards. So there's minimum effort needed. You need to go there to make sure no broken glass is on the ground, things like that. But pretty much the machine does the work and the parking lot sells itself, okay? So that's one thing. Now, some parking lots does have an employee there, depending on if there's a machine there or not. You know, so those are the kind of things I feel like somebody could be looking at. And maybe somebody here is a low-key millionaire. Maybe they have a vending machine somewhere or vending machines with an S. Parking lots with an S. Right? Laundry rooms with an S. Passive income. Okay, whose panties was those? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Now, where we going at with that? Okay, now sit here. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. All right, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What is your message for here? I'm hearing the Trey Songs song. <laughs> oh, you guys, oh my, coming into town. All right, what's going on here? <laughs> Let's see what's, where this is going at, okay? A woman right here, okay? We have a psychic, could be a psychic right here. Okay. What's the message right here, please? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Allow me now to be the channel. So the foot over here, we have liberation, freedom, and hope. Okay. So that's what I kind of feel. I feel like some of you, you really are thinking about some passive income. Something even could be about health. I mean, sometimes in vending machines, you could put things in vending machines for health, like Tylenol, um, you know, things like that. I mean, so many different kinds of vending machines nowadays, you know, so you could do that. You can even put something, something for panties or anything like that you could do, you know? So that's another thing you could do, you know? So I just feel like somebody here, this liberation, freedom, and hope right here. Okay, is that somebody here is free, I feel. Um, they're looking into a way of earning money around the clock, I feel. I feel like we have like a boss here or something like that. Somebody's a boss. Could be a Pisces right here, just Pisces right here. Could be a Pisces, I feel. Maybe somebody here has Pisces in their chart or something like that, okay. What's the message right here? It says karma at its finest right here. Look at that. Casino, gambling, lottery, all games of chance. So do you have a vending machine that has um lottery in it? I mean, usually that's the state, so that's probably not going to be you. I think that's the state that be doing things like that. But 
You definitely could put, um, you know, health things in there, like Tylenol, things like that. I think you could do that. Or like things like that, okay. Maybe somebody won a lottery right here. And they just invested in themselves to make sure the money keep going. See, that's what I was telling you guys before. Like, you gotta, you can't be like, all right, I win a lottery and then think you're going some shopping spree and get the, you know, get all these things. I'm not going to get deep into it, but get all these things that, I mean, maybe they do matter. I'm not going to say they don't matter to you, okay? Maybe they do matter to you, okay? But you also have to make sure in the beginning here, right? As soon as you get some low-key millionaire money, that you get a way for that money to work for you, okay? So you go ahead and spend $3,000, $4,000, 5000 on the vending machine, okay? That 5000 you invested is going to bring money back to you, right? So that's the thing about it when you win a lottery, right? Make sure that money somehow worked for you and come back to you, right? So get right here. Some of you, this could be the springtime. We're in springtime. Are we? No, April the 20th. Yeah, we, we, we came into the springtime. So we're in the springtime right here. So I feel like for some of you right here, if somebody here do, you know, somehow come across some type of money, there's many ways right here to make some money continue to work for you in some way. You know, real estate. Um, I told you the others, right? It's many ways. So yeah, that's how I feel. Looking into different ways right here to earn money. Maybe even selling pennies or you know tarot cards right here good health situations okay something like that okay so that's what i have right here so let me see what else we're going to get right here okay message here please holy spirit holy angels allow me here now to be the channel for this collective Find a way to get that money to work for you, okay? For somebody here, okay? Because trust me, we don't want to go back to the broke stage. We're not trying to do that, okay? So we want to make sure we get hold of some type of money, some large amount of money. You find a way to make it work for you in some way, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. The Empress, this amazing grace. How sweet the sound. You could create something new? Absolutely. Right here in Taurus season, the Empress is Taurus season. It's Libra season, okay? It has been able to create in some way, okay? If you don't want to be pregnant, use precautions. The Empress is the first card here. You can be very fertile. Some of you, you're fertile right now with creative ideas. Others of you, you're fertile, okay? So if you don't want to be pregnant, you need to use precautions for some people here, okay? Five of Pentacles right here. There's also female condoms, okay? So let's not get this. There's female condoms too, okay? To make sure that you're protected or something like that. Okay, Page of Pentacles right here. All right. So I feel like, you know, you're making, um, this is good news right here financially. Let's say, for instance, you didn't have any money. There is a way to earn money. I feel like there's a way to earn money. There's so many ways to earn money right now, okay? Um, so I feel like, you know, it's amazing grace right here that is going to bring you different ways of earning money. Okay, there's many ways, okay? Eight of swords right here and then five of swords. Okay, let me just get all the cards first and see what kind of message we're getting right here, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. I'm hearing like a cartoon or something. I don't know why I'm getting that. Are you drawing cartoon characters or are you, um, I don't know, something about cartoon? I'm getting right here. It's a way. Okay. You could be drawing it. You could be um, speaking like a cartoon or something like that. Okay, what is what else is here right here? All right, two of pentacles right here. Okay. This one right here was a temperance card. And this one here was the um, four of cups, five of swords. Okay, now let's take a look what we got here.
you don't have to accept poverty or something like that for some people here, okay? Um, because I feel like you're looking at many different ways of earning money, or these ways will met wait, 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 uh, these ways will now be provided for you or shown to you what you need to do, okay? So for some of you right here, I feel like you're gonna be figuring out all different kinds of ways of earning money or some way. Somebody here, um, it was a shallow victory. Something here was really a shallow victory. I'm getting right here, breaking your heart like this right here. I don't know if they broke your heart like that. See how that's doing right here? So that could be a shallow victory where you can't break your heart like that for some people if they broke your heart like that, okay? Or this evil could be a mother that did that to somebody right here. Or somebody broke the mother's heart or whatever it could go. You know what I mean? It could go any kind of thing. Um, this even could be a Taurus or a Libra. Okay. Let's see what's going on here with the Empress and the Five of Swords here, please. What is the message here? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels for this collective here. Allow me to be the channel, please, for the collective here. Ace of Wands right here. I don't know. I just feel like somebody was passionate right here about... I don't know. Ripping this. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. The pace, Ace of Wands is passionate action in some way. It's very fiery in some way right here. And then right here with this one, I'm not sure what they was doing. Was they saying something here about religion? You see the cross in, in the middle? Was they um, breaking somebody's hearts or, you know, some action they could have said or done to somebody right here? I feel it was definitely a shallow victory, I feel. Throwing that lash like that as something or somebody here it's shallow yeah yeah because you're consciously aware maybe right here or even could have been magic somebody was cursing somebody or something like that you know they could have been definitely taking some action like that right here okay now it don't have to be that deep maybe they wasn't cursing them maybe they was doing a magic spell to try to get somebody to be in their life, okay? And maybe they was defeated with that. You know, and some people right here with the Ace of Wands and the Five of Swords, though, I feel like with the Magician, it could have been a curse, okay, that somebody was doing for some people here. I feel like the curse is defeated with the Five of Swords. It's defeated right here, okay? Yeah, Six of Cups right here and a Devil card. Yeah, I feel in the past here, okay? Somebody shunned somebody right here about religion, I feel. These two right here. Right? And then this one right here with the cross right there. Okay? So I feel like something here was about religion for some people here. Okay? It even could have been somebody here that was portraying to be whatever they was portraying to be in religion or whatever else they was doing. Okay? I feel like right here, there could have been some black magic actually going on here. Okay? And I feel like, you know, I'm not sure if they was telling the truth about religion or something like that in the past or something. Or did they condemn somebody or, I don't know, blasphemy or magician right here in the devil? It could have been, they could have said something was the devil. They could have said, they could have said anything. They could have even did a black magic spell right here. They could try to curse somebody here in the past. Something like that. somebody's husband or something like that the king of pentacles could be a husband okay or somebody here was yeah i feel like they was i feel like somebody was cursing somebody right here in the past okay it like it was a husband a taurus libra gemini um or capricorn maybe there was a shallow victory right here during a black magic spell on the Empress or whoever else that was doing it on. Okay. Or on somebody's husband, something like that. It could have been. Okay. I'm not sure somebody here was doing a black magic spell on somebody's husband or the husband was or what. The mother or anybody it could have been. I feel like there was some conflict going on here with black magic in the past. Definitely. With the magician and the devil, it was black magic, I feel. This was black magic, I feel. Okay. 
I'm hearing like two liters or something, okay? So, okay, what else is going on here? Five of Swords right here, the Empress. The Hermit right here, a Virgo. I feel like somebody figured it out with the Hermit card right here, yeah. This is somebody here that goes deep inside and figures something out. So if there was some black magic spell going on here, somebody knows all about it, I feel. Okay, somebody in this equation knows about it. We have a lot of people here. Taurus, Libra, Virgo, Gemini, Capricorn. Okay, so it could be any of those people, but somebody here has figured out about it, I feel right here. Some action that somebody was doing, it was a shallow victory to do something like that to somebody here. Okay. Or on somebody's husband or the mother or whoever, right? Okay. I just keep hearing amazing grace though. I don't know. It's like it was grace that brought me here thus far. And it is grace that will lead me home. Something like that. Okay. Somebody here was very possessive. Somebody here was very controlling, I feel, right here. Okay? I feel like somebody's magic is defeated right now. It's time to get excited. It's time to be, to know right here. Okay? That, yeah, they can't hold you here or something like that. Yes. Like, this is wish fulfillment right here. That all somebody can do is look. They can't touch you or get possessive or whatever they're trying to do with their hands. Or like, they're like, like this or something, okay? Whatever they're trying to do, no. Okay, I'm getting my hand. Okay? Ooh, child, 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 child. Okay? I feel like it's your wish fulfillment right here. There's some black magic is defeated. Hmm. Somebody here was very possessive. They was very controlling. They was fighting through the spiritual realm. They was evil. They was wicked. Could be a mother. Could be anybody. Okay? Somebody was doing that to the mother or something. They was wicked. Whoever there was that was doing that. Mm. Right? Or something. Okay, they even could have been to the same sex or something like that. Were these two kings? Maybe. Or it was two people or something like that. Okay? They're stuck. They're stuck for some people. They're stuck sexually or something like that because they're into the same sex or they're into the opposite sex or whatever. Could be a Gemini. Okay. Somebody's consciously aware about their evil ways. Okay. They're consciously aware that they're bipolar, they're schizophrenic or whatever else. They're consciously aware of something like that. Five of Pentacles right here and the four of... um. Cups, okay. Somebody's left out on the cold. It's a missed opportunity. Okay. I'm hearing and their magical workings is ceased. Like this is done. So go ahead and dance. Yeah, they're gonna be heartbroken right here, I feel. Okay. They're gonna be heartbroken right here. How something here is not gonna go anywhere. I'm getting right here. It's a type of way. Okay. Or somebody's unwavering, something here is a missed opportunity. All that black magic energy they put into something right here is ceased, right? Sit back to the pits of hell, something like that, okay? Yeah, they have clarity right now. Yeah, they have clarity right here. Somebody has clarity, okay? That some magic is over or that they was doing magic. Somebody knows that. Yeah. You see the white bird right here? Stuck. In reverse, it's free. Somebody's free. Somebody knows you're free. You're free. So if it's a missed opportunity, you're free. So don't like that. Yeah, this could be a long-term investment. Or they want to harvest something. Could be the case. The temperance card right here and the page of pentacles right here. Okay, I feel like somebody was waiting for some magic to work. Could be a Sagittarius. They was waiting for the Sagittarius or something like that. I'm getting what a Sagittarius was. Okay. Right. Or well, somebody here is going to regret all that energy they put into something right here that's not even going to work. Hmm. See? They're going to be regret. I told you that. That's regret. Crying over spilled milk. Something like that. Right? Or something here not even going to work. All that evil they put over here. All of it. 
it ceased. <laughs> okay? It's going to stop right now. What I already did, sort of like that, I feel. It was illusion right here, okay? They could reconcile with you in the future. For some people here, it was illusion for some people right here, right? That they was even going to plan for something in the future, right? They're going to be regret for doing any of that. They're going to regret about all of it. Right <laughs> They're going to regret about something like that right here, okay? Yeah, because somebody's going to want to reconcile with you, and they was doing all this magic on somebody here, and I feel like they'll regret it. They will regret it. <laughs> the moon card right here. They're going to regret some illusion. They're going to have fear. Something is going to tremble and, and mess with them at nighttime. We'll get right here. Okay? It's going to haunt them. Let their evil works be done in this moment. <laughs> we call hell's fire upon it. Something like that. Ten of cups right here and the six of swords right here. It's time to move on. It's time for them to move on. Or you're going to move on from this. Some get right here. Right? Or some family right here is moving on. Or somebody's moving on. It's crazy. You're going to be able to grab both something like that. I feel. Okay? Or something here that's been going on in the family. Right? It's time for it to move on. The energy or whatever. It's time to move on. That's the truth right here. It's the sword. It's, that's the truth. Clarity here. Okay? Yeah. For some people, right? They're powerless at juggling you. So it's time for them to move on. It's crazy. It's time for them to move on. Okay. So somebody over here is very much aware of what somebody is doing. Okay. If there's any conflict right here in sex or whatever else, it's time for them to move on. Okay. Somebody's going to realize it right here. What's the eight of swords right here? The two of pentacles. You have the high front reverse right here. Okay, this could be a breakup for some people right here. And all this right here, they're powerless right here. You know why? Because they was over here condemning something right here, right? About religion or whatever else they was doing, I feel, right? And I feel like right here, this is a very religious card. It's in reverse. So I feel like they don't have wisdom and knowledge about something, so they're powerless. Okay, either they're powerless at emerge or they're powerless right here at doing something because they don't have the they don't have the wisdom to do it i'm getting my head you know the how front maybe even have the knowledge maybe they do know what to do right but they won't do it you know they don't have enough courage to do something right here right or they don't have the wisdom to know do it they don't know that right then okay something here is too hard for them i'll get the sense because they haven't had awakening i feel for some people here Right, or they, they do know some type of knowledge, but they don't have the wisdom to go and do it in some way. <laughs> something like that. Well, they don't believe in something, something like that. Hmm. Or they don't even believe in their self. So how are they going to do something? Something like that? Right? Yeah. King of Swords right here. Could be Aquarius, Leap of Gemini. The King of Swords is very intelligent in everything. But if they don't have the wisdom right here to know, all right, I'm going to go ahead and do that. As opposed to saying, oh, I heard that, but I'm not going to do it. That's on them. They have free will, and that's good. Because I'm getting right here. Them right here not having the wisdom to go and do something here, step away, is stopping them. You get right here. Mm. Okay, it's stopping them for some people right here, right? Because they're wicked anyway over here. They're wicked. Okay, they're wicked. Something that was doing, I feel, right here is in low vibration, I feel. That's the reason why they don't have wisdom right here to do something they need to do in some way. They may know to do it, but they don't have the wisdom. It's very different knowledge and wisdom difference, okay? Yeah, mm -hmm. could be a fire sign right here. Okay, if they had the wisdom, some people they just don't know in general. Others, they have the knowledge, but they don't have the wisdom to do it, I feel right here. And I feel like something right here, Ace of Pentacles, will set you free right here from this situation, I feel. You're going to get a new beginning. The world card, yeah. Some cycles complete, you get a new beginning. Some people right here, okay. Maybe you're going to get a new house, maybe you're going to get married now. Something like that right here. It could be some, some wisdom and knowledge right now. It's about a relationship. The king and the queen of swords, they're both in the upright, so that's pretty cool. But I feel like they're both intelligent. Somebody knows the truth about something right here. Okay. Okay, yeah. 
if somebody's feelings has changed for you and they're stalemates since I just seen the two of swords, you're about to know that. If that's the case, you're going to know that right now. Look at that. Two of swords came right back on here. You're going to know if somebody's stalemate right here. Okay? The universe don't play. There's two of swords. Okay? If they're a stalemate, they're a stalemate. It's pretty. Somebody's going to realize that in a relationship. Okay? It's too hard to be a stalemate in a relationship. Something like that. Somebody here is intuitive and they're psychic. That's what I have here. Okay? Thank you so much. I send you all peace, blessings, love, and light. Namaste to you.